Hello everyone, welcome back. Today on Astro Colony, I'm going to show you guys how to properly set up the harpoon connector, docking stations, and mining drill for your planetoids. First thing you want to check is to make sure you have the correct technologies. Press T on your keyboard. We're going to make sure we have Cosmic Harpoon for the actual harpoon connector, mining for the drill, and docking for the docking station. Second, we want to make sure that the Cosmic Harpoon is properly placed at the edge of our station. So we're going to place one there. And you also have to make sure that your Harpoon is connected. Let's just do a little floating here. To the planetoid that you want to bring to your station. You have to make sure it's on the edge of your... Boom, right there. Alright, let's float all the way back to our platform. Now that we are back at the station, make sure that your Cosmic Harpoon is powered with a carbon reactor. So we're going to go ahead and set that up here. The power port's on the side, so I'm going to just set it up here simple. Go ahead and connect all the wires you need to. Put fuel into the reactor. Make sure the reactor is turned on. You're going to go ahead and enter the Cosmic Harpoon with F. Aim at your other cosmic harpoon to attract the planetoid now that the planetoid is close enough to our platform we're going to enter the cosmic harpoon with e and select dock and it'll automatically link the two cosmic harpoons with a docking station now keep in mind each one of these Cosmic Harpoons and the Docking Station require 5 power, right? So there's 2 Cosmic Harpoons, the Docking Station is an automatic give. So out of 10 power, this entire generator is being used. Now that our planetoid is successfully connected to our platform, we are going to pull out a drill. And if you notice, there's 3 grids here for our drill, okay? you want to make sure that the grid is over the desired resource. Next, we need to set up our generator for the drill. So we're gonna pull out another carbon reactor. Go ahead and power it up. Now that the mining drill and the generator are set up correctly, you need to ensure the conveyor belt is set up as well. So we're gonna pull out our conveyor belts and you need to lay them going to your docking station. If it comes to a hill or a crest here, simply press one for your conveyor belt again and it'll change platform and direction. Now that our conveyor belt is set up properly, go to your docking station, enter with E, and ensure that line one says out. Next, pull out your storage unit, ensure the storage unit intake is facing the proper way, align it with your conveyor belt, and you should start seeing the resources pile in any moment. Let's go ahead and turn on the generator. Generator's on, the drill is on, drilling our iron resource, and there we go. We can follow it all the way to the end. You can clearly swap out, you know, the storage unit for any of your smelters, anything like that. However, keep in mind, the more powered equipment you have, the more generators you're going to need. And that is how you successfully attract planetoids, connect the docking station, and start gathering resources passively. Tune in next time for more how-to videos on Astro Colony. As usual, I love you. I'll see you all next time.